Welcome back to my channel guys, it's your girl Coco Styles and on this channel we talk about beauty, fashion, lifestyle and styling guys. I am super excited about my new hats that I have purchased um, and I wasn't going to do a video at first but I realized I should and the reason why is because summer is here and um, a lot of people like to wear hats in the summer but wearing wool hats it's like, I don't know, it's like a no-no in the summer. Like it's gonna be super hot, so I would always recommend trying to find like straw hats and stuff um, that are like the fedora hats. So I have two hats here that I got from Brixton. And let me give you guys a quick, I guess like a quick little review on their packaging. Their packaging is absolutely horrible I hate it um the packaging it's not like lack of color where they put it inside like that hat hat piece where the top sits in um the box is very cheap so the last two times I, I wasn't gonna buy anything from them again after the last time but I really wanted these hats and I hadn't seen them anywhere else with this um extra piece on the brim but they use a very cheap box so both times when i got the item the box was like literally smashed like pancake so um i asked my neighbor to pick it up for me and she showed me the box and i, and I know she showed me because she's like oh my god it's smashed um so i asked her to open it for me and they were good these were good but the last one that i bought it was like so smashed in and actually, I don't even think they put that other piece in here. But yeah, if they ever come across this video, just guys, um, you guys need better boxes for shipping for hats. Just invest in it. It'll save you a lot of money, save your clients, your customers, the headache of returning something. Um, and it'll save you guys from a bad review. So here are the hats. I got two because I actually have three of their straw hats. Actually, I have all three of their straw hats. One is um, like a light cream color with, um, I guess, this rust color brim. Um, that's the original one that I got. And that one came with no issues with the box, none of that. Um, this is the second one. Now, I'm going to tell you this. Right now, off the rip, they sprayed this hat. I smell it. I'm not sure what they sprayed it with, but it's really strong. Um, now I could return it because it's cracking in some air. I don't know. Can you guys see that little? Oh, yes, you can. Do you see that little piece right there? They sprayed this hat. Um, and it's not a good smell, like at all. They're... I'm sorry to say this, but I don't think it's a good... Mm. My, my other hat is fine. Maybe because it's just a straw color. But this is this is not good. So now, if I return it, I have to put it in another box, right? Um, to send it back. But this is, this is, this is not good quality, guys. So, I would not recommend this black straw hat. I'm probably gonna keep it and just like spray it with something. It's a really strong smell. It's not a good smell. But that's the black one. Let's see how the other color looks. Yeah, they did a they did a they did a poor job. Oh, they did a poor job with this. Don't buy the black one, guys. Don't do it. I tell I warned you. <laughs> um, yeah, they didn't do a good job with the black one. That looks like something from Etsy. Seriously. Um, Alright. And th this is like a true unboxing because she opened it, the box for me, but I didn't take them out of the wrapper. She look I saw the little piece, but I didn't take them out of the wrapper until today. So they tried their best with it, but no. This one, this one was also sprayed too. Yeah. However, this one is better um 
Yeah, this one is better. It still stinks. But the inside looks like this. So this one is better, but they gotta, come on guys, like, come on. You don't want a bad review out there for you guys just like rushing through things and not taking your time to send things to your customers. Um, I can't even put it on my head because I have this stupid thing on, but I did get, what did I get? I got a, a large? Yes, I got both of them in a large. Um, they are both adjustable, meaning, let's see. Yes, they have like a little elastic piece on the inside. And, well, like Velcro, you can pull it and you can like make it tighter. So if you have your hair, you can tighten it. Um, if you wear a wig, you can just leave it out big. But all in all, they're nice hats, but that black one, it's a no-go for me. <laughs> I'm probably gonna keep it because I'm telling you the hassle to send it back is gonna be ridiculous. Um, and I was being petty the last time. I sent it back in the lack of color box because it had everything in it. I didn't want, it was so smashed up. Um, it just wasn't, it's just not good packaging. And I, and I said, I hope they see this um, and they just do a better job with their shipping, um, shipping their hats. These are straw, so the wool one that I got, oof. This, I, I ain't gonna lie, I like to stick with lack of color because I know when it comes here, and it's coming from far, it, it ships quicker than Brixton. Did I say these were Brixton hats, guys? <laughs> these are Brixton um, hats, so. The black one is probably a no. Well, don't get the black one. Let me open it again. Yeah, don't get the black one. They just did a shitty job, guys. Like, shitty. I'm gonna have to come in and spray my own situation on here. And get some of this strong smell out. Now I'm thinking about my hair. To see, let me see. Yeah, both are large. You guys can see those little marks on there. That little mark right here. That's just paw spraying. This is probably spray paint. Um, there's a couple of more down at the bottom. Um, there's some on the top. They didn't do a good job. So if you guys are watching Brixton, you should send me another hat. <laughs> so you guys can redeem yourself because this is not good. Um, like I said, I'm, I know I'm gonna keep it. It's very hard to find a black straw hat. Um, whatever they sprayed it with is just not the best. It does stink, guys. It does. This is made in Mexico. So the largest 60 centimeters, it says seven and a half. And It's coming from California. The nerve. All right. So those are the two hats, guys. Let me just pull them both out again for you guys to see. I have some other stuff, but I'm going to wait and do a separate video. Um, a clothing haul. Just so I wanted to just kind of focus on these today. But here are the two hats. <laughs> Yeah, this one is cute. This one, mm-mm, mm-mm. Yeah, this one is not as strong. I wish I could show you guys the other one. It's just in my closet, my other closet. Um, but this right here. But that's it, guys. That's just two hats that I purchased. So summer is here. Um, I do not recommend wearing wool hats in the summer <laughs> because your head is gonna be hot. You can get away with it at nighttime, possibly, depending on where you are from. But other than that, I would say try to stick with something that's a straw hat um, so your head is not sweating. And ladies, if you are wearing a wig, it's really gonna sweat with the hat on your head, a wool hat. So <laughs> just try to be mindful of that. Um, what I do like about the hats is that they have that extra piece at the brim that makes it stiff 
right? So it's not gonna floppy flop around on you, which I like. Um, so that's it, guys. If you like videos like this, more hauls and stuff, let me know. I would definitely share my things with you guys. Um, I wanted to give a kind of like a really deep, detailed one because I know she told me about that small uh, issue on the black hat. Um, I actually just opened them on camera just now for you guys. But she showed me on FaceTime. I really couldn't see the other stuff. Um, but these are them. So if you like videos like this, please comment below. And if you stay to the end of this video, please comment Coco We See You. And guys, don't forget to follow me on Instagram at Coco Styles NY and my other one, Coco Styles NYC, which is my personal page. I am strictly talking about tall girl fashion. My business page is Coco Styles NY, where I am talking about styling for corporate professional women. So they are different. My blog is Coco Styles NYC. And my styling services website is Coco Styles NY. I know it's a bunch of Coco Styles, Coco Styles, but that is what it is. And I also have a boutique, guys, and it's Coco Styles Lux, <laughs> which is on like hold. Right? Well, it's not on hold, but I'm trying to change some things. But comment below if you stay to the end of this video. Comment Coco, we see you, and I will catch you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.